Nomad, I've got Pakatari on the line. Sounds like he needs our help. Put him through. Hola, compadre. I have a problem in Itaqua, and Bowman says you might be able to help. My people need help. There have been many losses to the cartel, and the horrors inflicted by Yuri Polito have broken their spirit. The fires of revolution have almost gone out. Spare me the rhetoric, Katari. Just tell me what you need. There is a cartel supply convoy passing through the province soon. Capturing it would give my people much needed supplies and restore their morale. Can you do this? Consider it done. Taking orders from Pat Katari now? Katari needs this convoy. We are gonna give it to him. The more he depends on us to get shit done, the more we can get out of him in return. Point him out. Next to the sandbag emplacement. Drone is airborne. Ready? Open fire.
document mentions an Unidad captain who sends prisoners to Yuri and Polito for interrogations. He's got to know where our lovebirds are, but he's sitting in an Unidad firebase. That's one down. Rally up, people. It's like a fueling schedule for an aerial supply run. Cartel's got a cargo plane about to head out from a strip near here. How about we take the plane ourselves, fly it to a friendly strip and give it to the rebels? Good for them, good for us, bad for the cartel. It's nothing as pharmaceuticals are worth to keep their victims awake. See, back in the day, the real torturers didn't need drugs to keep their victims awake. So they're amateurs. That's obvious from how few people survive their interrogations. A real torturer, a professional, he or she is in control. He or she understands what's needed. Yuri and Polito are sloppy. They get carried away. Pakatari's rebel movement is on the verge of defeat. If we help him turn things around, we'll be able to count on his support in the future. They do it for the fun of it, not because it's a job and not for the art. So yes, they're brutal, but not because they try to be. They're brutal because they're incompetent. You've got a dark side hidden under that smile, don't you?
a target carrying submachine guns. Marking a captain. Get ready, fire. Oh. Kill confirmed. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. Hey, I found a Santa Blanca medal. This will make a nice souvenir. I think Santa Blanca gives out a lot of these. These supplies will buy us a lot of goodwill from the Rebels. We got a 20 in the garage where Pleto parks his sports car. We snag that, we snag his GPS. Maybe something there tells us where he and his girlfriend are. Pakatari's Rebel movement is on the verge of defeat. If we help him turn things around, we'll be able to count on his support in the future. We've learned that an Unidad captain named Fuentes has been working with Yuri and Polito. Interrogate Fuentes and see what intel he can give us. Hang on, I'll drive. <laughs> Okay, this is the Unidad Firebase. We're looking for the captain who's in contact with Yuri and Polito. We need the target alive. Roger that. Ooh. Sniper up in the tower. Deploying drone. Got eyes on the tango. He's got a lot of background. Here we go. Got it. Eyes on the Unidad captain. Marking a hostile. He's close to some locals. Thank you. 
sniper, top of the tower. Go down. Get down before they see you. weapons case over here. I've been wanting one of these. Silencio, marche. What the hell is this? How's it going, fuckstick? Pendejos. You are dead. <clears throat> Mierda. You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo. Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. You can't trust them. It would be a relief if I took them out of your life. Look, I'm not a snitch, but let's just say, yeah, they freak me out. The thing is, they're not even in Itaqua. So call them back to Itaqua. Tell them you've got a package ready. Uh. Oye, Olito. I got a lamp ready for delivery. No detecto nada en la zona. Vale. Uh. Uh. 